We now return to our regularly scheduled program. Good morning, guys. Kenzie and I just had breakfast, and now she's trying to get in all of the cupboards. Um, the vlog is uploading as we speak. The upload's taking forever for some reason. I'm not really sure why, but that's okay. Come here. Come here. Today we have a lot to do. I really want to clean up the house, do the dishes, get all of our clothes hung, and things like that because I know it's super hard for Sean to get ready in the morning when he's trying to get to work. And it's just hard for us to find anything or get around the house at all. It's, it's ridiculous. So I really, really want to do that. I need to go to Smith's because she needs stuff to eat. But anyway, I hope you guys are having a good day and a good week so far. Here's to Tuesday. Yay! Do you guys want to see the mess I'm dealing with today? First of all, Kezi went crazy in the living room. So there's all that. And then on top of all of that, I have... All of that. And don't you worry, because there's more in my bedroom. So that's what I'm dealing with. I'm trying to get like all of this stuff into where it needs to go, except for her dresser. So I'm trying to get all of that put away. Here we go. like a freaking workout bringing everything up the stairs seriously you guys like so much crap and it doesn't even look like that much but I promise you it's a lot and it's hot well somebody woke up yay and I made some serious progress in our bedroom which makes me really really happy <laughs> Because now when Sean gets home, he won't have to help me other than just moving the dresser into her room. And then I just have to load, unload like all of her clothes and stuff that need to be put away too because her room's a disaster as well. But things are coming together and I'm really excited. So we are back from the grocery store. All groceries are unloaded and in the fridge. And Kezi is down for a nap. I want to show you guys what... I found it at the grocery store, it's pretty cool. That's better. So I found out that Kezi is somewhat lactose intolerant. So we stopped giving her cow's milk and now we give her almond milk. And I found these, they're lactose free. How cool is that? So they were like 10 for $5 or something. So I ended up getting those instead of her regular yogurts because I figured she's somewhat lactose intolerant and I give her yogurt like every day and her eczema is better, it's just not gone. So I think that might help because she's not getting milk. Like the milk and the yogurt, you know? And then yesterday I was with Amanda and I was like, I really, really, really need a baby gate. Like I just really need a baby gate so that Kezi quits like trying to get up the stairs and trying to get into places that she shouldn't. And I got this. Yay! It's a dream baby, baby gate, safety gate, I guess they call it. And they're like regularly 90 bucks or 95 bucks or something like that. But I got it for 20. <laughs> Used, obviously, but it still works really well. Everything is perfect on it it was just like a little dusty so i just had to clean it but it's perfect and she can't get out well actually i just put it up and she's taking her nap so we'll see when she gets back or when she wakes up if she can get out or not but yeah those were my two really good finds in the last couple of days sean is at like this work thing so hopefully he records something so 
that it's not just been, John really hasn't been in our vlog much because he's been so busy with work. Also, thanks everybody who has been saying that I've been doing a good job vlogging. I mean, not vlogging, editing, because that seriously is so sweet of you guys to say that. And I feel like I suck at it. So when you guys say that, it makes me really grateful. So thank you. All right, guys. I'm talking to you very closely because I'm holding things in my hands. And it's fine. I know I look super fat. We don't need to like make a blog about it like Olivia's kinkles or anything like that. How many Bachelor fans are out there? Holla! Comment below if you're watching The Bachelor and we can chat about it. I just want you to know that I went upstairs, I took a shower, and then I realized I haven't even edited yet. So I came back downstairs, got my computer and the camera and water because I'm thirsty and my charger and I will edit and there will be a live video for you guys tomorrow at 9 a.m. <sighs> you guys better be freaking thankful. But seriously, I just asked Sean if I'm going to be the editor now. And he said, probably. We'll see if maybe I can convince him to, to edit while he's not out of town. And I'll edit while he's out of town. What do you think? Hmm. We'll see. Sean's playing a video game. I'm playing an Apple TV With video the game. Apple TV, yeah. Should we say goodnight to our YouTube friends? We probably should. I just don't know how I'm gonna do it right now when I'm, I'm dying in the video game. He just game. crashed. He's Life back is alive. hard. Back yeah. alive. Life is hard when you're dying. Kill that guy. How about that? Sucker. Take that. Well, everybody, you have a good night. I'll leave you with some words of wisdom. <laughs> Our vlog should be called fart vlogs or something because this is ridiculous. <laughs> At least I can contain mine. <laughs> oh man. I controlled it. He did control it. He's so good at controlling his farts. It's so weird. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. It's what I do. <laughs> it's what I do. I'm a professional gastrotomatrist. Yep. It's a thing. Look it up. You Googleize it. All right. All right. We're going to bed slash editing. Good night. Good night. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.